I'm Steve Breen, and I have been the editorial cartoonist at the San Diego Union Tribune since 2001. I won the Pulitzer Prize in 1998 for the Asbury Park Press in New Jersey, and in 2009 I won one here for the Union Tribune. It's a real honor because the Pulitzer is an award that people outside your profession have actually heard of. I actually kept both Pulitzers in a box up until about two years ago when I got them framed. Not custom frames because this is modern American journalism. I just went to Aaron Brothers and bought two frames at a two-for-one frame sale. I'm looking for a news topic that inspires me. It's hard because sometimes there's no interesting news happening. Or sometimes there is interesting news happening, but the muse isn't working. But I take my notepad and I write down the big topics du jour while sitting, reading the internet, or reading newspapers. And usually my pad winds up with eight or ten topics. After I've filled my brain with the big topics of the day, I need to start thinking up ideas. I come up with anywhere between two and five sketches a day, and they could be on the same topic or they could be on five different topics, it just depends. But most of the time I have to stare at my pad and really think hard about how I feel about the topics. After I've sketched them up, I'll take them to my editor for him to take a look at. Some days I'll just show one if I really want to draw that particular cartoon, but most days I like to give him a choice. Showing my ideas to Bill, my editor, is a daily ritual. It's not really fun, not because Bill's not a good editor, but because it's hard to create something and stand and watch someone's face as they judge your work. I'm William Osborne, and I'm the director of editorial and opinion department here at the Union Tribune, which means I'm responsible for setting editorial policy for the newspaper, writing editorials, and I'm ultimately responsible for all the content on the editorial and opinion pages, including Steve Breen cartoons. A good editorial cartoon is, first of all, timely, pegged to the news, in response to the news. It has to be simple. People need to understand it quickly. Uh, it needs to be provocative, cleverly drawn. He's not just good, he's really one of the very best in the country. So after Bill approves the idea, I sit back at my desk and I go to finish. This is where I go over the pencil on the rough with ink. Today I'm redrawing the whole cartoon on a better piece of paper using my T-square to get the lines of the microwave oven just right. This process takes anywhere from 30 minutes to two hours depending on the level of detail and depending on how close I am to deadline. The cartoon has to be approved, inked, colored, and in the system by five o'clock every day. It's kind of like a creative treadmill that I live my life upon. But the news is always different and changing and that makes it exciting. The UT is a great place to work. I love my bosses and I love my coworkers. There's an energy about newspapers that my psyche plugs into every day and it's just fun to get out of bed and come into work in the morning.